He's going to give you something good to hit, but don't look hard. He's not overpowering at all. He's going to go 89 to 92. Max averages about 90 on his force. Ball carries well on a hot, humid Sunday afternoon. And he has missed with his first two pitches to Merrifield. Aida has walked 20 and 56 and two thirds. Inside three and oh, Maeda looking for a rhythm. He missed. Three and one. He's a, a, a very smooth delivery veteran pitcher. He, he knows how to pitch. He's teams have made some adjustments on him. Well, Maripi leads things off well for the Royals by walking. And they fast with Merrifield might see some fastballs. Takes a swing at the first pitch. With Took a shot at left field, but now down in the count 0 and 2. And who knocks it foul? I thought it was really funny. A uh, story that Mike Matheny told us. I will gladly let you in if you believe you're ready. Just did get a piece of it. Yeah, so this is where it can get tricky face, facing Maeda. He, he's got a lot of different pitches. That split finger change up is defender on the left side of the infield. How long does it take if you come left field here? That would really help him for his timing. Instead, he pulls it to the right side. They flip it to second, and that's all. High in the air, deep to right center. Kepler under it, backpedaling near the track, and makes the catch, and back to first base goes Benintendi. Has given up 11 home runs this year. Ball one. Lefties have hit six. Knocked foul. He's able to get that split -er on the inside corner. But if it's up in the zone, it can be hit a long way. Salvi, though, chases a splitter in the dirt and strikes out. So Kenta Maeda will face Ryan O'Hearn. And Ryan ready for that first pitch, but lifts it foul, and that will be strike one. Nice idea, thinking opposite field against Maeda. This was a guy who throws 70% off-speed pitches, and it's, it'd be hard to look for that fastball. You got to look being called up. He's patient, been more patient, a little more selective, and not swinging as hard. All those things together are going to make him a better hitter. That's what he is. He's an offensive player and since hitting 293 with three home runs. To the right side and fielded by Kirilov. He'll come back to the bag for the first out. He's going to try to trick you. He was acquired by the Twins on February 10th, 2020 from the Dodgers in the National an ERA. He was second in the Cy Young voting. But like you said, adjustments have been made mid-June. So you, so you shouldn't check his swing twice. He throws off-speed pitches 70% of the time, and he gets his ship over there, HUD. And you said every pitcher threw a split over there. Yeah, that's a pitch that's taught there. They, they, they're not uh, known as taught at a young age. Yeah, the guys who throw extremely hard usually wind up in the major leagues. Guys like Otani and Matsuzaka and Darvish. Right. Nomo was pretty yep. good. He's over the balance point. Yep. But Dyson has gotten it before. Five for 14. With Teased him away with that splitter. I mean, Gordon is way in and said. Oh, there it Back was. Back our way. There it was. That was the one he wanted. Just. Competing just like 
There you go, a base hit. The right field by Gerard Dyson. So he continues his success against the Twins. Sebastian Rivero. And he tries to drop under right. That's a hit. Dyson races to third. He'll make it safely. And Sebastian Rivero has his second major league hit and his first at Kauffman Stadium. Let's try to stay away from the bunt, although he's an easy target to bunt. Good swing. He sees that left side wide open, right? Will show me fastball up. He's had trouble with that fourth. Foul ball. Any, any mistake to shoot him to left. Uh, and the ball is pulled to the right side. And Kirilov will make the play. And Maeda gets out of trouble. Ball one to Witt, who walked his first time up. Tino is 45 for the season against one ball club. One ball, one strike. There's that slider, this time in a good location. Witt swinging over the top. Kansas City win. Since taking two of three from Boston. And there is a swing and a miss on another good slot. Fouled off. I like what he had to tell Joel Goldberg that, you know, can't do nothing about the past. As the Royals were five. And left to the All Star break. Took a chance with that pass. Chase it's what he wants him to do. And Andrew chases it. And that's back to back strikeouts of two good hitters in Merrifield and Ben Attendee. Strike one. Right now he looks like the pitcher that off of it. Santana barely missed a pitch to his liking and skied it to deep. My head, it doesn't go that deep into ball games. He's only. You now this is how you gather momentum and also deceive the hitter. Yeah, I like it, and I don't know why we don't see as much go. But he's been pitching that way his entire career. Remember the old Royal Paul Bird, the way he oh, used yeah. to kind of almost flap his own McDonald at LSU. It's quite a deucem. Duo. And Santana is the third attendance from England. And it kind of reminds you the Salvador Perez back in January of 2020 when we watched him. He's got his all star gloves on. Loves America. I think that's really proper in because you know if you think about it Salvi's the Royals property and for him to go out there and I mean more than half of his home runs have been hit to right and center field fouled off even though he's a natural pull hitter guy like uh, of his size he wants to play 162 doesn't bite on that splitter that's the pitch he struck out on his first time up down and in it's festive and ready Let's give him one he can hit. Uh, nope. Good location with that four seam fastball, and that's the case. Well, he's been able to get the Royal hitters to chase today. O'Hearn goes after the first pitch and skies it to left. Under it is Larnick to make the catch, two out. You know, that's the thing. The pitchers who have thrown. 37 innings or more and another first pitch off the plate seen first pitch strikes 11 out of 15 getting ahead that's his key All right. he gets a ground ball 
or a strikeout. Good job there. All sliders and splitters. He won pitches. Chases a slider. Not one fastball to hunt at Yankee Stadium. Yeah, no, it's a pretty special moment and a good guy. Try Dyson will lead things off. Strikeout on this day in 1980. There is a swing and a miss. Well, Father Howard would go with other engineers every Sunday and also holidays to Yankee Stadium. And but she did keep the memory. Yep. And there is a breaking ball down two and two. Now Ada to Dyson and Gerard takes low three and two. Well, you'd love to get him on to lead off an inning with his speed. Yeah, and you know, there's been several opportunities for walks for the Royals, but they, they're. Gave himself another chance after. But he's allowed the Royals only two hits today. And Dyson swings and misses seven strikeouts for Maeda. Shows bunt takes a strike. Teased him away, him away all year long. Well, you know, he's due for a good outing, and, and so far he, he's making it happen himself. He's getting ahead of the Royals hitters, and he's got them swinging on his to the White Sox in his last start. And Rivero hangs around a little longer. Another split finger coming. That's it. To third. Arise throws out Rivera two out. That he deserved it. He didn't get on the last day of the season last year and this year. He threw out the opening pitch, but there. Yeah, let's hope he does. Maple syrup. <laughs> Here's the pitch in there for a strike and a 1 1 count to Nicky Lopez. Even Lopez. Sounds familiar. In there. Almost 5.2 in the Royals, almost five and a half. And there is a swing and a miss. That is the eighth strikeout. Did he get it? Put that slider up. And that is strike three calls. So he does get the. Strike one. The sixth inning is our Sonic Slam inning. Our contestant is Anna Treps from Overland Park. Grand from Sonic and the Royals become a Sonic Slam contestant today through the Kansas City Royals ballpark app. But nice play by a rise. And Well, his loss was really devastating because and it was a fracture in his rib. Carol oh. foul with two strikes on Ben and One and two. Nine strikeouts for came to the Dodgers won 16 games his first year. Check swing and that's strike one. Let's see if my Aiken can make a mistake. Does not. Gonna have to be patient on him. He's been getting chases all day. Struck him out. Boy, this is the pitcher that Minnesota saw 95 pitches. 
Ooh, Carlos had a good swing and a force. Just barely, just barely outside. Wow, and Maeda wanted that one. And Santana almost comes out of his shoes and strikes out, so a season high. Thank you.